A look at the starting 11. First for Houston, led by interim head coach Jeremy Hurdle, who took over in early September when Kenny Bundy was named an interim assistant with the first team. It's a 4-3-3 look for Houston. MLS experience up front. Gabe Siegel who brings 13 first-team appearances and two goals into the matchup tonight. He's flanked by Andy Ibatioha and the 15-year-old Matteo DiMorelli. Last year's Mac Herman Trophy winner, Usman Sila. He's proven to be a capable offensive presence as well. Played some big matches for the Clemson Tigers. Contribution here today could help keep Houston's season alive. For Whitecaps FC2, led by former U.S. international Ricardo Clark. It's a 4-4-2 shape. 19-year-old Miles Morgan and 17-year-old Ryan Alumi up front. Alumi making his first MLS Next Pro start today. Vancouver have clinched their spot, but again, a chance to sneak up to the sixth spot in the Western Conference table. These young prospects, of course, want to continue to prove that they may deserve first team reps down the road. Rico Clark will make sure they're ready to go. Underway here at Sabercats Stadium, Houston in the home orange. Manuel Mate. Going to clear it out of the area in the back third. Really high pressure from Houston, giving them possession back. Marco Illich will throw it in here for Vancouver, making his 15th appearance of the season. Attack-minded fullback has been very consistent in the course of this season. shootout loss last time out for Vancouver. They scored in the, the 40th minute. They had the first goal against Austin. Goldthorpe off the assist from Nicholas Florial Chateau, who is not listed today in the lineup. Leads the team in goals so far this season. Austin equalized just four minutes later on the goal by C.J. Faudry. First time these two teams have Scored off this season. And that was given away. Lofted in towards the near side. The foul negated anything before that. Open field here. The flag stays down. Early chance for Houston. Trying to cut off the angle here. Spill the cross. And defended well in the end. Vancouver gets out of that. Di Morelli was in the open field. And that was inches away from crossing the goal line. What a chance here off the set piece on the other end from Vancouver. Job still not done, though, here defensively for Whitecaps. Sergeant. Looping it over. That will trickle out of play. See how this happens. Valdez, excellent distribution forward. Morelli, really difficult angle to do anything with. And Dakala did everything he could, influencing that sequence. Did enough. at Welton, Milosevic making it a difficult angle. As this is into the box, Houston here. Went down, and there is a whistle. Houston will go to the spot. A chance for an early advantage here. Working well out of the combination from the midfield. Really not much there. Just an individual move, trying to get central from Siegel. And a clumsy challenge in the end. And 
Dynamo Dose, a brilliant opportunity here, just about a half hour in. As Gonzalez will step to the spot. Gonzalez puts Dynamo Dose ahead. A critical goal for Houston's postseason aspirant. Club return, Di Morelli, Gonzalez. Siegel, shot ripped and scored! It's Gabe Siegel making it 2-0 to Dynamo Dose. And Houston really have liftoff now at Sabercat Stadium. A critical goal. So they blow it any second here. And given away, and that will end the first half. Everything Dynamo Dose was looking for. Under the 20-year-old. Out of Calgary, who joined the academy in 2020. 22nd appearance of the season. One assists on the campaign. Also played in the League's Cup as well. So Linder into the match. Back underway, second half. Action here on Apple TV. AJ Ricketts alongside you. Houston doing what it needs to thus far. The Real Monarchs have taken a 1-0 lead. That is not. This Dynamo Dose side wants to hear. A foul defensively on Matei will lead to a free kick here. Gonzalez to take the free kick. It's a good ball in. Oh! Off the post and into the arms. Somewhat quiet today. Now back to McKenzie. Johan working in the center of the pitch. Dispossessed. Bovelina to his left. Good pass near side. This shot is ripped, and Vancouver have one back. It's Ryan Alumi in his first MLS Next Pro start. 2 1, our score. A 17-year-old from Edmonton who joined. Arzu's going to come in for Di Morelli. And Siegel, one of the two goal scorers, will come off for Isaiah Reed. Coming into the field, number 11. Reed, the 34th pick in the 2023 MLS Super Draft, also former Clemson Tiger. Time NCAA champion. Next on Arzu, the 20 year old from Honduras, making his 12th appearance of the season, does have three goals on the campaign. Houston have now utilized three substitutes. Out of play from Bovelina there. Good cross to the far side here. 
Great acceleration towards the inline. Set across and in! What a goal! How about that burst from Arzu on the far side to create the third goal for Houston? Both Dynamo players around the mouth of goal. Valverde, Arzu, Reed. It all started with a beautiful transition to the far side. Arzu brought it down brilliantly. Made an electric run. Dropping his defender, creating an angle. Isaiah Reed punched it in. Fourth goal of the season for Isaiah Reed in his 23rd appearance. The goal scorer at Clemson. And a goal scorer here in H-Town. Finished his collegiate career with 14 goals. Had a brace in the national championship in 2021. Big time playmaker. 3-1 Houston is this shot. Trying to get one back was Clark. Deflating moment there for Vancouver. Just offensive brilliance from Houston. Clark's able to get the shot off. Nothing in the end. Houston out shooting Vancouver 11 to 3 today. came in from Real España. Still continuing some good combinations here. This is sent in towards the far post. Good ball in from Bati Ojas, trying to get in on the party. Diving, stop. Back towards the inline again. This is sent to the near side, headed back. Sargent will chase down. Brief sigh of relief after Vancouver and made it. Cooper was in on goal. Cooper needs something here quickly. Towards the end line, Vancouver will keep it in play. That collision. No whistle. Mary went down and now it's Arzu in transition. Exxon Arzu tapping it forward. Just off the right post. Arzu already with the assist. Length of the field there. Mary went down. Almost able to tap it to the right side of goal. Got enough on it, just missed on the angle. Houston making their fourth substitution. Tioja will head to the bench. Excellent day for him. Steven Anor. Fourth substitute for Houston.
Well, the final whistle blows here. A 3-1 win to Dynamo Dose.